Time now 6.20, time for an all new Verify now on Wake Up Central that's very timely this week. Here in the South, snow days give us a rare chance to sample some snow ice cream. Generations of families have enjoyed a bowl or two, but there are some worrisome posts on social media about what's inside this wintertime treat. A fresh blanket of pure white snow is a beautiful sight. Great for sledding, snowballs, maybe even dessert when mixed with some sugar and milk. But before you take a bite, let's talk about what could be in those flakes. Is it safe to eat snow? Let's verify. Our sources are the Mayo Clinic, NationwideChildrens.org, and a microbiology professor at UA Little Rock. Generations have been doing it for years, even saving a snowball or two in the freezer for a hot July afternoon. Snow may seem like it's nothing more than frozen water, and technically it is, but as it falls, snow can soak up pollutants. According to the Mayo Clinic, scientists have found pesticides, sulfur, mercury, or formaldehyde in snow, though at very typically low levels, meaning you're not likely to get sick. Health experts advise collecting snow a few hours after it falls and scooping up the freshest layer from the top. We spoke with Dr. Nawab Ali, a microbiology teacher at UA Little Rock. He says while there's no harm in a little snow, there could be in larger amounts, and it's the color that really matters. Color should be very white, snow white. It is formed from evaporated water. So it is pure water, better than the water you get in our faucet. So we can verify that, yes, you can enjoy a little frozen fruit from nature's winter bounty. Like with most anything that tastes that good, however, moderation is key. So guys, did you ever do that? I did kid? it as a kid, but I've not done it in years, to be honest. Mm -hmm. okay. Oh, I did it two days ago. You did? I was, yeah, I, I was growing steaks on my deck, and I'm like, oh, why not have a little bit? So yeah. 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 I, did, some cream. I couldn't resist. I, <laughs> I just took a little, you know, there was, pro I think I think I measured about three and a half inches on our deck. Okay. So oh, wow. I just kind of just why took a little not? bite right off the top. Throw in did some food coloring, too. The kids mm -hmm. love it. You can make your snow ice snow cone. cone. Yeah. Yeah. I couldn't, yeah, I couldn't help it. Yeah. Couldn't yeah. resist. I'd always heard growing up, you wanted to wait till like, the second snow. Yes. Mm. To clear some of the pollutants. But okay. I, yes. I always thought, well, the second snow needs to really fall like pretty close <laughs> to the first <laughs> right, one. Right? Otherwise, right. you're just doing it well, all over again. And the pollutants are collected as it falls, right, which right. you probably know meteorologically. But I learned that yes. <clears throat> it is as it's falling sure. that it picks up all these nasty things in the environment. No, I, I had diet snow. I'm watching my weight. Yes. 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 Well, I didn't get the regular snow.